Boy, if you were to ask most folks what they're thankful for today, spending Thanksgiving in the hospital, I don't think would be very high on their list. Not really, except for the Herzl family from Falmouth, Kentucky. As Lanny Brannick explains, their stay in Children's Hospital has been miraculous, and their first Thanksgiving as a family, a special event, even in the hospital. Stephen Lane Hartzell was born November 12th, a perfect pregnancy according to his mom, Jennifer Hartzell. There was no real morning sickness. Um, Lots of UDF. <laughs> Until November 12th, Lane was perfect. Then during his birth, it was a picture perfect labor. Everything went wrong. Lane's head was extremely swollen. When he was born, one third of his blood was between his skull, skull and, his skin. and his skin. Baby Lane, as he's called, was in very serious trouble. He had a burst blood vessel in his skull, and doctors were using terms like brain damage and respirator. You know, they weren't sure if he would make it or not, if he'd be able to breathe off the ventilator by himself. Or eat um, on his own. Or, or eat on his own. 16 days ago, the Hartzells weren't sure if they would even go home with the baby from Cincinnati Children's Hospital, but today they are celebrating. Thankful to God, they say, even in the hospital. We will be here at Cincinnati Children's. Um, we will be picking out on the cafeteria food. But the holiday won't be all lost. Despite a grim prognosis from doctors early on and still many lingering questions about the long-term outlook for baby Lane. He's breathing on his own and eating Normal bottles norm like any other baby. And The Hartzells are headed home tomorrow. We're getting ready to be discharged. Bringing home the newborn they were unsure would survive just a little later than scheduled. And for that, the Hartzells are truly thankful. Lanny Brannick, 9 on your side, Coryville. Tyler and Jennifer, Jennifer Hartzell say they plan on spending tomorrow curled up in their own house celebrating Thanksgiving as a family for the first time that are a little late than never. And I say amen to that. I mean, that family is what together and that baby's going to be just fine.